40 years ago today, Nolan Ryan became the strikeout king of MLB. There may be no better measure for evaluating an MLB pitcher than strikeouts. Baseball, when simplified, is a simple struggle between pitcher and batter. If the pitcher gets a strikeout, he has shown his supremacy. Nolan Ryan breaks Walter Johnson's 56-year-old career strikeout record of 3,509 with five strikeouts in Houston's 4-2 victory over Montreal. Ryan was 36 years old in his 16th full season in the majors, and he still had 10 years to go. From 1966 through 1993, he played 27 seasons in the major leagues with the New York Mets, California Angels, Astros, and Texas Rangers. Ryan's all-time strikeout total would be 5,714. The legendary flamethrower was the first to routinely exceed 100 miles per hour. At the conclusion of his career, he was still reaching the top 90s. Ryan struck out more than 300 batters six times in a season, another of his 51 MLB records. The last time he achieved it was in 1989 at the age of 42. Other K records include 15 200 strikeout seasons, four 19 plus strikeout games at a lifetime, and 16 career 16 plus strikeout games. He always fanned hitters at an incredible rate. Only Ryan, Pedro Martinez, Randy Johnson, Trevor Hoffman, and Sandy Koufax have more strikeouts than innings pitched in their careers. The Hall of Fame right-hander won 324 games and pitched seven no-hitters, the most in history, the latest coming when he was 44 years old in 1991. He also threw 12 one-hitters, tying the great Bob Feller for the most in history. Ryan, astonishingly, never received the Cy Young Award. And at the age of 22, he captured his sole World Series ring as a reliever and spot starter for the 1969 Miracle Mets. Ryan's record is unlikely to be broken. For starters, no future pitcher will ever survive as long as he did. Randy Johnson is in second place behind Ryan by 839 strikeouts. The current active leaders are Max Scherzer and Justin Verlander, who are more than 2,500 points behind. As for Walter Johnson, who was previously a semi-pro pitcher in Wiser before getting hired by the Washington Senators in 1907, he reached his total in 21 seasons. However, he only made 802 career appearances, five fewer than Ryan. Lynn Nolan Ryan Jr. is a former professional baseball pitcher and sports executive from the United States. Ryan pitched for the New York Mets, California Angels, Houston Astros, and Texas Rangers during his 27 Major League Baseball, or MLB, career. Ryan served as the Texas Rangers Chief Executive Officer, or CEO, as an executive advisor to the Houston Astros after retiring in 1993. He was elected into the Baseball Hall of Fame in 1999 and is largely regarded as one of the all-time best MLB pitchers. Ryan was a right-handed pitcher who frequently threw pitches that exceeded 100 miles per hour. Throughout his pitching career, he maintained this velocity. Ryan was also noted for his deadly 12-6 curveball, which he threw with extraordinary velocity for a breaking ball. Ryan was an eight-time All-Star with a career win-loss record of 324 to 292, or .526. He has 5,714 career strikeouts, which is 839 more than second place Randy Johnson. Similarly, Ryan leads second place Steve Carlton by 962 bases on balls, walking more hitters than any other pitcher in MLB history. Ryan's lifetime batting average against is also a major league high of .204. Ryan, Pedro Martinez, Randy Johnson, Trevor Hoffman, and Sandy Koufax are the only five pitchers in the Baseball Hall of Fame who had more strikeouts than innings thrown. Ryan is one of three players in history, along with Jackie Robinson, whose number was retired by Major League Baseball and Frank Robinson, to have his number retired by at least three clubs. Nolan Ryan was born on January 31, 1947, in Refugio, Texas, a tiny town in the state's south, just south of Victoria. Ryan was the sixth child of Martha Lee, born Hancock, 1913-1990, and Lynn Nolan Ryan Sr., 1907-1970. For the Houston Post, the senior Ryan ran a newspaper delivery business that required him to get up early in the morning to prepare 1,500 newspapers for distribution across a 55-mile route. Children were expected to assist with daily duties. Ryan's family lived in neighboring Woodsboro, Texas, in Refugio County until Nolan was six weeks old. When they relocated to Alvin, Texas in Brazoria County, Nolan used to like throwing items at any target when he was a kid. Baseball, according to his father, was a better use for his arm, so he urged Nolan to play. Ryan began playing baseball when he was nine years old, made the all-star squad when he was 11 and 12, and pitched his first no-hitter a few years later. Aside from pitcher, Ryan played a variety of positions. Ryan could toss a softball over 100 yards in junior high, 
Ryan stopped playing football after the ninth school year after a tackle and fumble caused by future NFL running back. Norm Bulage convinced him to focus on baseball. Ryan played in 27 seasons, more than any other player in Major League history since 1900. Ryan leads all-time in strikeouts, minus 5,714, hits allowed per innings, 6.56, and no hitters, 7. In addition, he ranks 8th in innings pitched, 5,386, 2nd in games started, 773, 7th in shutouts, 61, 14th in wins, 324, and 3rd in losses, 292. Opponents hit 204 against Ryan during his career while having a 309 on-base percentage against him. In addition, he held batters to a 298 slugging percentage. Ryan struck out 15 or more batters in a game 26 times, second only to Randy Johnson's 28. Bill James emphasizes the contrast between Ryan's positive and negative statistics. While ranking him as the 24th best pitcher of all time, he remarks, Ryan has been retired for almost 10 years in 2001. Perhaps in another 10, we'll begin to get a little bit of perspective on him. Ryan's record of outstanding triumphs is as long as Bill Clinton's little black book. His list of defects and failings is long but dry and will never make for interesting reading. Other writers have gone into further detail on James' broad concerns. In a 2003 editorial for ESPN, Rob Nayer noted that while Ryan was one of the 20 finest pitchers since World War II, he often had trouble throwing strikes, and he wasn't any good at fielding his position. While arguing that Ryan deserved to be in the Hall of Fame, Nair referred to Ryan's record-breaking walks total and stated that his 309 on on-base percentage against wasn't even close to being in the top 100. Ryan and Frank Robinson are the only two Major League players who have had their numbers retired by three different organizations. On June 16, 1992, the California Angels retired his number 30. On September 15, 1996, the Texas Rangers retired his number 34. And on September 29, 1996, the Houston Astros retired his number 34. The Rangers retired his number as the first. Ryan was elected to the Baseball Hall of Fame in his first year of eligibility in 1999, with 98.79% of the vote, 491 out of 497 possible, six votes shy of a unanimous election and the fifth highest percentage in history, trailing Mariana Rivera, 100%, 425 out of 425 possible, Derek Jeter, 99.75%, 396 out of 397 possible, Ken Griffey Jr., 99.32%, 437 out of 440 possible, and Tom Seaver, 98. He opted to wear a Rangers cap for his HOF plaque to honor his Texas roots, as well as the fact that his 300th victory, 5,000th strikeout, and final two no-hitters all occurred while playing for the Rangers. He was the Rangers' first Hall of Famer. On June 25, 1967, Ryan married his high school girlfriend, Ruth Holdorf. Nolan and Ruth were classmates at Alvin High School. Ruth won the state championship in high school tennis. Reed, Reese, and Wendy are the three children. Reed and Reese were both TCU Horned Frogs pitchers. Reed also pitched in the lower levels for a short time. Reed was named president of the Houston Astros on May 17, 2013. Nolan routinely pitched over the offseason, with Ruth usually donning catching gear and acting as his catcher. For a few summers, Ruth Ryan also coached their boys' minor league teams. Nolan Ryan lives in the Cimarron Hills neighborhood in Georgetown, Texas. So that's all from today's video. If you like this video, please like it, subscribe for more sports news, share your thoughts in the comment section, and share it with your friends. See you soon.